Good evening, and welcome to the stream. Happy Wednesday. I hope everybody's having a wonderful Wednesday. My god. Wednesday. Hmm? Can you believe it? We made it to midway through the week. Truly is a... Truly is a magical, wonderful day, huh? Dan Meekin, thank you very kindly for the 14 months. Howdy, PJ. Hope all is well. All is very well, thank you very much. Uh, I'm feeling good, I'm feeling uh, excellento, uh, just in time for some Minecraft. Uh, Magic Zay, thank you very much for the Prime sub. Also, welcome to the Sweet Potato family. Grab yourself a Sweet Patat. Uh, so, guys, it is evening for me. It is evening, it's gone 7.30 p.m. Uh, so I am gonna be doing a, it's gonna be a bit more chill. But we are going to uh, go on an adventure. We're going to go on a Minecraft adventure. We've been playing a lot of hardcore Minecraft recently. Which, if you're unaware, is a really hard Minecraft mode where if you die, the game ends. So, in theory, stressful. But, in practice, we're going to be fine. Uh, Emma Dickinson, thank you very much for the three months. Millennium, thank you for the 100 bits. Got off work early due to uh, the inaug inauguration, aka American Things. So uh, so very happy to be here uh, with full attention to deliver these beautiful bunches of bits for another survival stream. Thank you very much. We will be, hopefully, surviving for a whole other stream. This is our sixth stream now of surviving in Minecraft Hardcore. 
Satan themselves. Thank you for the 100 bits. Your streams finally convinced me to pick up Minecraft for the first time in five years. Uh, and I've been having the best time playing with my partner. Keep up the good vibes. Thank you very much, dude. Yeah, it's great to play with people. It's great fun to play with people. Um, Ainsley Stevens, thank you very much for three months of wonderful subs. Uh, enjoy that silver sweet patate. You earned it. Da -bum. Bum, bum. This couldn't have come at a better time. Just the thing I needed to help me feel better. Well, everybody is welcome here, and I do hope the stream makes everybody feel 100% um, excellent. Uh, Chanevas. Chanevas? Thank you very much for the sub. Very much appreciated. Thank you. Uh, Dr. Ghost Expert, thank you also for the 10 months. A doctor of, of ghost expertise. Uh, I know who to go to when I've got a ghost problem. Fortunately, I currently have no ghost problems. Um, well, 10 months. Quick question, PJ. Did you and Sophie ever finish Enjoy Avatar, The Last Airbender? Thanks for the awesome streams. Thank you very much, dude. We actually have not finished it yet, no. We're on the season three, but we didn't finish it. So, uh, we, we will at some point. We're a bit s sucked into the office again at the minute, so, but we, uh, we do need to finish Avatar. Uh, Nad Janikol? Nadja Nicole, we got it. Thank you very much for the six months. Six months already. Oh boy, I hope you're drinking lots of water. Stay safe. Thank you very much, dude. Very much appreciated. Uh, Kay Kenobi, thank you for the 100 bits. Sending bits again for uh, good luck. Also, my name is pronounced like Kai, not K. Ah, Kai Kenobi. Kai Kenobi, is that correct? All right, well, thank you for letting me know. Um, play Stardew or play Stardew whilst watching. Uh, play, well, to play Stardew or not play Stardew whilst watching. Dude, fire it up. Fire it up. Play some Stardew. Play along. Uh, little Sangdori, thank you very much for the Prime sub. Welcome, welcome to the Sweet Potato community. Scarlet, thank you very much for the 100 bits. Favorite episode, season, quote from The Office? Go. Ooh. Favorite episode? <sighs> Jeez, that's so hard. There's so many great moments. Um... I feel like I had one in my mind recently. I was thinking about like one of my favorite moments in the office. I honestly, my mind's gone so blank. I'll have to have a think. Uh, Nat the B, thank you very much for the sub. Thank you very much. Uh, Cheyenne, uh, welcome. I'm in an email uh, purgatory. Thank you for this late uh, night stream, PJ. I'm sorry to hear that you're in <laughs> email purgatory. That does not sound like a place that I would want to be. Um, but yeah, I hope, uh, yeah, hope you find yourself. I hope you can pull yourself out. Uh, the one with Kevin's curry. Oh, the chili, uh, where he's made that giant vat of chili. I mean, that's the thing. Save Bandit! <laughs> Identity theft is not a joke, Jim. See, these are all great. Oh, Scott's Tots. My God. We got Scott's Tots coming up. We're, we're just about to end season... Uh, we're just about to end season... Um, uh, what do you call it? Season... Five. <laughs> what do you call that number that comes after four? Uh, five. <laughs> Sorry, Earthbound music is making me go a little loopy. Yeah, Office has so many great moments. So many. Uh, the episode we just watched was the one where Michael Scott Paper Company gets bought out. Gets bought out. <laughs> mm. Yeah, the dinner party. Actually, maybe that is my favorite episode. The dinner party episode. Um, with, uh, yeah, when they go over to Michael and Jan's. I finally broke down and bought myself... A plasma TV. <laughs> a fifth... Whoa, I can't know. He doesn't even say the the size. A flat screen plasma TV or whatever he calls it. Um, yeah. Oh, my God. That's a $200 plasma TV. Our Chromecast. Uh, we always call our internet after, like, funny things. Like, as in, well, we... Like, I think our previous internet was called... Um, we've had Dunder Mifflin. We've had Shroot Farms. Uh, and we call our Chromecast, like... Michael Scott's plasma, $200 plasma TV. So when you've got Chromecast up on the TV, it you, it says in the corner of the TV, Michael Scott's $200 plasma TV. <laughs> I am snowed under. Thank you for the nine months, dude. That's a Twitch baby right there. Wait, nine months? Yes, nine months. Oh my God, that is a Twitch baby right there. Thank you very much, dude. That's a whole baby. That's a whole, one whole giant baby. <laughs> Is it possible to get mod? I'm looking to help out streamers. How do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, as in, uh, I think we're okay. Thank you very much. Uh, we've got a few mods, um, but if I need any more, I'll let you know. 
Yeah, the music. What is this, Animal Crossing? <laughs> I just got here. Is this the beginning or the end of the stream? Uh, it is the beginning. It is the very beginning. We are at the very beginning. In fact, we're going to jump in in just a moment. Uh, I want to let you know my general plan for today's stream. Uh, we're going to be doing a mission. You ready? We're going to be doing a mission today. What I am calling the Four Corners of the World mission. Something like that. Something like that. Uh, Akio Ku, thank you for the two months. Uh, started watching your streams during our second lockdown, and they helped. Uh, they helped a lot. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much, dude. Thanks for coming along. Thanks for coming to the streams. Always appreciated, dude. Um, the Four Corners of the World mission. What is this mission? What does it mean? Well, in the game, we have a map. We have a map, right? Today, I want to visit every corner. I want to go top corner. I want to go northwest, down to the left, and back to my home planet, my home island. I don't think I'm going to fill out the entire map, but I just want to see what's in each corner. I just want to get a feel. Just want to get a feel. Just going to get a feel for it, you know. That's the plan. That's what we want to do. Maybe we will discover another village. We've discovered three so far, so maybe we'll discover another one. Hopefully we won't get killed. But yeah, that is a quest. It certainly is a quest. Uh, so what do you say we jump in and we get questing? What do you say we get questing, everybody? Fujiland. We do need to do more to our house. But we did a lot of that yesterday. So I think what I'm going to do is today is going to be a... A, str uh, a stream where we, we uh, give me a second, give me a while, just a second to load up. It's always like a tiny bit laggy every time you load it up, but here we go. All right. We're good to go. So let me get myself uh, suited up for this. I've got armor. Perfect. I need food. If I'm going to go out on an adventure, I need food. I'll probably take a bit of iron just in case I need to. Actually, I don't. I'm not going to need iron. Although I will make myself some tools. It bothers me so much that the chest room is uneven. Uh, the chest room is unfinished. It's not uneven, it's unfinished. Uh, we didn't get a chance to finish it yesterday, but we will um, at some point. These will become double chests. At some point in time. Uh, we don't need this door, so I'm going to put this in the box with all the metal stuff. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, yes. So this is what we were working on yesterday. This little basement area. Oh, it is pouring it down outside. Not a good not a good time to go outside on an adventure. But, uh, yeah, this is um, our little hut on our little island that we've walled off. We did that yesterday as well. And we've got this little underground section now. This area is going to be the chest area. And I think eventually we'll probably cave this out into something else. Uh, do I have a floating cactus? <laughs> All right, yeah, we've got a floating uh, cactus. All right, I'll take a bit of cobblestone, just in case. You never know when you're going to need a little bit of cobblestone, a little cobble. A stable would be good, yeah, at some point. All right, let's take a bed with us in case we need to sleep on the road. Did I move my chest for the tools? I feel like I did. Did I not? Did I not? Maybe I put them in the barrel? All right, I guess not. Wait, 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 wait. Where did I put that chest? I am confused. Oh, it's here. All right, well, let's take another sword. This sword is on its way out. It's not a reliable sword, but it is a sword. This is also a sword. We'll take a pickaxe. We're not going to be doing too much stone cutting. We will take our map for sure. We'll take a one of these. We'll take one of these. We'll take a, a boat, even though we might not need the boat. Okay, I'm going to need some more torches. Uh, and I think as well, I'm going to quickly change the music. Uh, as much as I love this, I think we need to take it back a notch. We need to chip. What actually? What I wanted to listen to? I wanted to listen to relaxing Zelda. Is there like such thing as village music? I want mu like village music. Every Zelda town village music. Perfect. That's what I wanted. 
Uh, okay, so we got some torches, which we're going to want on our adventure. Uh, do we want anything else? We want we swords, shovel. That's basically it. I'll take a crafting table as well, just in case. You never know when you need to get your craft on. And then this is the map. This is what we're looking at. So if we're doing this Four Corners mission, I want to go all the way north from here. Then I'm going to go all the way west to the left, the northwestmost corner. Then all the way south to the bottom south corner. And then go all the way back. So this is going to be quite an expedition. This is going to be quite... I might even take a bit more food. Um, in case I get the hunger strikes, you know. Raw beef. Let me cook up some more beef whilst we're getting ready. Let's get some more beef in effect. Uh, no, beef. Um, so I think I've got everything I, that I want to take with me. Yeah, I got everything. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait for this beautiful, delicious steak to cook. And then maybe, I don't think we can sleep because I think it's a thunderstorm. Oh no, we, we can sleep. All right, the thunder has subsided. The thunder has subsided. Beautiful morning. Let's get our beef and go. Get the beef and get out of here. That's what I like to say. Get the beef and go. I think, yeah, I think I've got everything. Maybe I'll take a bit, a bit of dirt as well. Um, yeah, I'll take a bit of dirt. You never know when you might need a bit of dirt. I should really use up this sword first. I don't like having, like, a bit of, you know, durability on a sword. I like to use up the weapon and be done with it. Uh, and I don't think we're going to be doing a ton of mining underground. This is more of an overground exploration mission that we're going on. Love it. Mm -hmm. Shovel. If I need another shovel, I can build one out in the open. Not worried about that. And, uh, yeah. Iron ingots. I think we're good to go. Let me just wait for this last steak to cook and, uh, we'll get going. Thank you, Amber. Thank you for putting that in the chat. Yeah, that is the shader that I'm using. No texture packs, just a shader. All right. Check it safe. Um, I could take my horse, but I think I'm going to go on foot. I think this is an on-foot mission. And you know what? Uh, yeah, this is an on-foot mission. Alright, see you soon, guys. Off we go. I'm going to leave... I'm just going to leave the horse, because if I take it, I'm going to have to commit to horse action, you know? And... Oh, shit, my shield. Yeah, we're probably... We're going to run into some some evil doers. So hang on. <laughs> We're going to just quickly return. There will no doubt be some evil out there that we might need to strike down. Yeah, there's our little compound. It's as safe as can be at the minute. We get the occasional zombie in here, but you know, we're we're doing the best we can. Where is my shield? I thought I would keep it in there. Did it Did it break? Oh, it's here. Okay. Alright. Amber away again. Take two. <laughs> Why are there chickens outside? Um, I don't know, dude. Don't ask me, ask the chickens. <laughs> dun, dun. Hey chicken. No time. Adventure awaits. In fact, we need adventure music. If we're going to be adventuring, we need adventure music. We're off. This is an adventure, guys. It's time for adventures. No time to talk about chickens. Uh, I will say, though... Uvi! Uv is rare! Thank you very much for the two months. Good morning to you. Are you ready for an adventure? Because I am. I'm very curious about what's down there. We will uh, go see what that is... at some point. Not just yet. Not just yet. I don't have a clue what's going on. We're going on an adventure, Orla. We're going on an adventure. We're doing the Four Corners mission. We're going to go see the top... We're going to go to all four corners of the map. What if it's all just ocean? Then it's all just ocean, baby. 
then that's what we've got to play with. But I've got a feeling it's not going to be all ocean. I've got a feeling. I've got a good feeling about this. You know what? Let's get that in hand. In hand. Yeah. Off we go. It must be so, like... It must be so odd to hold your map like that <laughs> whilst running. Hello, villagers. So this is uh, the bridge village that we named. We named it Bridge Village because it connects to our bridge. Who knows what we're going to find out there? We might find some... Uh, in fact, switch back over. Switch music again. Whilst we are still on an adventure, we're in a village right now, so we need some village music. So, north we go. Uh, I might just actually very quickly sail across this bit of water here. Save energy. We need to keep our food. You know, we only have 32 steaks. <laughs> Which is, uh, you know, not is not much to keep me going. All right, let's hop out, hop on, pop out. We go. Punch the boat. Now I'm seeing a little cave over here, but I don't think that's like a temple. I think that is just a, that is just like a, yeah, a little cave. I don't think I'm interested in going in there right now. See, there's like other islands out over there. We're not going to visit those, though. Not just yet. We are on a mission. The Four Corners mission. Get me up there. Let's go. Alright, so we're about to start discovering new land in a moment. New possibilities. What could be out there? Let's find out. So I see some greenery. So there's definitely a lot of desert up ahead, but it's just in the middle. It's kind of sandwiching a bit of green sort of foresty area. So we'll see what's out there. We'll see what we find. We'll fill in the middle of the map at some point, uh, but for now, the Four Corners mission, the Four Corners of the Apocalypse, we're going to visit. And we will be gathering resources along the way if we need them. We'll be camping out overnight. Ooh, more horses. Hello. I should really remember to bring a saddle with me, actually, if I do find a horse that I can just sort of, like, ride around. Although, do I have... Yeah, I have... Oh, I only have one saddle at the minute. That was the problem. We only have one saddle. We're a bit limited on certain things at the minute. There's so many horses, though. Damn, dude. Well, it's good to know that this is where the horses are all hanging out. We're going on an adventure. What is that over there? Is that... Mm, there's nothing... I... Well, it seemed like... It looked like a pumpkin, but... We don't need a pumpkin. You cannot craft saddles, I don't believe, no. You have to find them in places. Hello, chickens. I'm not from around here. I'm going on an adventure. Who knows what we'll find out there, you know? But we've got our trusty map, so we'll always find our way home. We'll always find our way home. I've never been this far from home before. It's kind of scary in a way. I think he said, good luck. Beautiful. <gasps> Is this a village? Village numero four? We just found a fourth village. All right, well, let us uh, quietly sneak in and see what they've got for us. See if they've got any goods for us. I heard a spider. Woo! Emeralds, bread. I'll take the bread. In fact, I'm going to take all of this. Yeah, this is nice. I might... Uh, I'll see how long we spend here. Uh, I'm debating... I'm debating... Uh, staying here for the night. Let's see. Got anything good for me? Oh, 
What do we call in this village, guys? We, uh, we've been naming all the villages we've been going to to keep, help, help us keep track. What do you want to call this one? This dude has a tree blocking his entrance. More bread, some leather pants. No, thank you. Tree Town. I like that. Tree Town. It's nice. What is this again? This is not... Is this a block of... Oh, it's just a block of stone. Nah. I'm okay. Oh, hello, sir. What do you trade? Leather pants? Leather tunic. Get out of my face with that shit. What about you, sir? Leather for emeralds. Good to know. There's the golem patrolling the town, making sure everything's uh, nice and safe. Okay, we'll check out these houses. Now, I am very tempted to... Uh... Can I get in here? Oh, yeah. Ooh, I think I already have a stone cutter. So I don't need this. I'm tempted to sleep here for the night, you know. I'm tempted to sleep here for the night. Is this like a stable? I like how they've done the stable. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm gonna just find a bed. I'm gonna find a warm bed to crawl in for the night and just uh, sleep. What about arson? Are you asking me to commit arson? What are you doing standing on the on the chest? What is happening here? This is how they this is how they sleep in this village, I guess. I'm fine with that. All right. The adventure continues. I'll remember this place. What do we call it? Tree Town? I'm not sure we, why we call it Tree Town. I think there was like one tree in that town. <laughs> but there we go. These shaders are beautiful, aren't they just? Boom, 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 boom. Ooh, what is this? <laughs> is this another desert temple? Holy hell, we've been getting very lucky. We can get very lucky with these. This is a desert temple. Hold up. Well, I think it is at least. Hold up. In that case, we must handle it with precision and care. There are traps in here. And I will not be caught with my pants down. Skelly men? Ooh, lava. Okay. Now, what's this lava all about? Why is this desert temple built? Oh, I see. It's. Oh, Jesus. They built next to the lava for some reason. Okay. Let's handle this with care and precision. We need to get down here safely. One wrong move and this place is going to go boom. Whew. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. There is a trap down here rigged with TNT ready to blow. And I do not intend for this run to end because I stepped on a a block of TNT. The pressure plate is done, though. Ooh, a bit of iron. I'm excited by two blocks of iron when I got four chests. All right, are we gonna get lucky? What's gonna be in the chests? Let's find out. First of all, let's get rid of this TNT. Whew. All right. Nicely done. Very nicely done. What do we get? Are we lucky today? We got sand, gunpowder, bonds. All right, well, I don't want a lot of this stuff, so I'm going to get rid of it. 
kind of want the TNT, but then when am I ever really going to need TNT? I'll hang on to it for now. Wow. More rotten flesh. Some more iron horse armor, which I guess I'll take. Ooh, we got a, a magical book of Riptide 3. That's quite a fun enchantment. It's quite fun. Ooh, another saddle! <gasps> and more horse armor. Does that stack? It does not. More sand, more bones. Why are there so many bones? Ooh, emeralds. Yes, emeralds. I'll take some gold. I don't know if we really need the gold, but I'll take it. Uh, Nuaji, thank you very much for the 200 bits. Been missing a lot of streams lately due to uh, oversleeping caused by a lot of stress at work. Uh, but yeah, here's some uh, here's some cheers for good luck. Thank you very much, uh, dude. Very much appreciated. Uh, I hope you've been enjoying the stream today so far. We're doing uh, we're doing a mission today. We're going on a mission. Uh, Nightly Blues, thank you very kindly for the Prime sub. I missed a saddle. I don't think I did. Did I? There was two? Two saddles? Wait, what? Did I check every chest? Maybe I mistook it. Oh, I must have mistaken it for... Ooh, it was blending in with the rotten... Uh, <laughs> with the rotten flesh. Cool. Alright, thanks for the heads up, guys. All right. Ooh. Do we go down this way? Absolutely not. I don't want to take any risks. Well, we've basically actually found the top. This is a corner. We've we've reached almost the top corner of the map. And we found a desert temple, so that was pretty cool. And with two saddles, we can saddle up the next horse, and uh, that'll help us get across the land a bit quicker. Nice. All right, is this a safe area to change music over? I think so. All right. Let's keep going. I do like doing those uh, those desert temples. I see another structure in the distance, but I don't think it's a temple. I think it's just like another one of those wells. It might be worth checking out. It's going to be going off the map a tiny bit, but... I'll, p I'll poke my nose in and see what it is. I'll poke my nose in. Uh, so far, so good, though. Corner one completed. Nutley, thank you very much for the Prime sub, dude. Much appreciated, thank you. Welcome to the sweet potato community. Yeah, this is just a well. This is just a boring-ass well. Nothing exciting. Funny looking, nothing cooking. Let's get back on the map. That's just like me. Funny looking, nothing cooking. So it, I'd be I'd love to find another biome. I hope this isn't all just desert. Alright, we're heading to the northwestern corner. What will we find? There is savannah up ahead, so I'm hoping that we get some interesting variants. Some savannah. Zoe Stark, thank you very much for the nine months. We've had a baby, a Twitch baby. Enjoy that ruby sweet patat as well, dude. Uh, is this an open game to join? Uh, unfortunately, no. This is a just a solo game for now. Uh, this is just a solo adventure, a one-man hardcore adventure, one man trying to survive with uh, permadeath on the cards. Around every corner, death is a possibility. Oh, are we getting up to some water here? We might be. So we might be sailing across the next portion of land to get to the next corner. Yep, it looks like it. All right. Let's uh, go ahead and put that in our hands like so. And get going. That person, thank you for the 100 bits. May all your adventures be blessed with wonderful loot. Thank you. Uh, wonderful loot is my favorite thing. I do love finding wonderful loot. Um, no matter what rarities there are in the games, I always love stumbling upon diamonds. It's always, uh, it's always fun to find some diamonds. I've been, uh, discovering netherite in my, uh, in my, in my Switch game I've been playing. Um, I've got some nether, I've got basically, I've got some really, I'm, what I'm doing in my Switch game, I'm trying to sort of get a, I'm trying to get a feel for like certain things about the game. 
that I can try and do here on these streams. So, like, getting netherite armor would be amazing. And if I could enchant it all to be really powerful, that would be awesome. No, I'm not playing on Switch right now, sorry. I'm playing on PC. I've got another... I'm playing with some friends on Switch. I've got a little world on Switch as well, where we've just been sort of being, you know, funky. Miss Short Gal, thank you very much for the three months. Three is my favorite number. Hell yeah, dude. Well, thank you very much for the three months of subs. Yeah, the music's great. I love, uh, love, love, love uh, Dragon Roost. Oh, we've gone off the map a little. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. We're back on. So if you're just joining us, by the way, uh, hello and welcome. We are doing... Ooh, now that's a drop. Look down there. Holy hell. We are doing a mission. The Four Corners mission. I thought of it today whilst I was in the shower. I was like, oh, you know what would be cool? If, uh, yeah, I'm thinking about my... I can't stop thinking about Minecraft. <laughs> in the shower, in my dreams, at night, in the breakfast. In the breakfast. At breakfast. In the breakfast. Um, I'm going to need somewhere to find... To sleep, actually, quite soon. Yeah, I'm going to want to sleep quite soon, I think. Maybe I could sleep in the side of a cave. Might not be a bad idea. The Four Corners mission is where we, uh... Where we're going to visit every corner of the map to see if there's anything interesting out there. And then eventually we'll work our way inwards. Alright, I think we need to start getting ready for the night. Because the night is coming. Let's just go in here. <laughs> this will be safe, right? Let's just dirt it up. Dirt, dirt. I don't want to have to use this sword, but I will. If I, if I, if I really have to, I will use the sword. Okay. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Is it morning? Is it safe? I think it's safe. Well, let's keep going. Uh, also, a bit more information on the game. We're playing a uh, hardcore mode, which means that I think all the enemies hit a bit harder. I don't know if it changes anything else about the game in terms of like drop rates or anything like that, but it certainly makes the enemies hit harder. And if you die, you're done, son. You get one hit, not not one hit, sorry, one life, and then you're done. Just like real life. Is this something? Is this something up here? This It's not another desert temple, no, it's just a stack of sand. It's just a pyramid of sorts. Okay. Yeah, it just seems like a pyramid. God, it really is all desert, isn't it? So much sand. Alright, let's run. Let's run for it. I want to get home to my cat and my horse. I don't want to be living in this desert all my life. I think the the outskirts are, are... We've got a lot of desert on the outskirts, but I think if I was to go inland, there's a lot more... There's definitely a lot of savannah. A lot of trees out that way. Sort of foresty areas. I'd love to find a jungle, so I could get some sort of some some parrots, maybe, um, some bamboo. Well, so far so good. We haven't encountered anything that's going to potentially kill us, other than that lava. That lava lava was pretty lethal. I thought after yesterday's stream, yesterday's stream was, we were doing so much building that I thought it was about time we actually did a little bit of an adventure. We put ourselves at risk, you know. Maybe yesterday there wasn't enough risk. We were playing it safe in our house. And I thought, let's get out there. Let's see the world. Let's see what the, the world has to offer. It has pigs. Hey, pig. It has adventure. 
has mystery and wonder. Oh shit. Okay, well, <laughs> we missed the jump there. Get me out of this hole, please. I am seeing horses, which I think means we're gonna... Oh, mama! Right. Right. Uh... <laughs> Good to know. Now, with these horses, I think I'm going to take a horse. Oh, shit. Uh, how do I do this? I need to... Uh, uh, who, who the... Who the... Who the fist Kyle? Did I say that correctly? Thank you very much for the 500 bits, dude. Much appreciated. Thank you very much. Come on, horse. Let's go. Let's let's adventure. Let's do it. This is literally a pona. Come on, it was meant to be. Noah IRL, thank you for the four months. Yay, four months. Just wanted to say thank you for another uh, great month of streams, dude. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Let's get this. Uh, let's get this horse suited and booted and get out of here. All right, we can travel in style now. There's a swamp of some kind up there. All right, well, this is gonna make life a lot easier. I don't think we're gonna take this horse back to our island unless. Somehow we do. This is this might be a temporary horse. This might be a horse that gets us from A to B until we need to get in a boat, and then we may be leaving the horse behind. All right. Well, we're reaching the second corner, and I don't. There doesn't appear to be anything useful. Oh, there is one. All right. We've reached. So the this corner is officially a swamp. Is that a swamp or is that just, yeah, it seems swamp-like. So I think we start making our way down now. Although I will not be happy. Hang on a minute. I need to fin I need to fill in the whole corner. I'm a sucker for filling in, in these maps, man. I need to fill the map in properly. How do I swim again? There we go. Let's actually fill it in properly. Is there a witch? <sighs> Maybe. I don't know if I want to face a witch. I think I'd rather get back on my horse and get out of here. This is not working very well. I suppose I could have got in my boat, couldn't I? That's exactly what I'm going to do. All right, I hope my horse is still there. <laughs> He's still there. Uh, right. Let's get you good to go. Let's get going. All right. Let's keep getting this map filled in then. Uh, we're going now to the next corner, which is the south uh, southwest corner in our Four Corners mission to see what we can find. Uh, no Brain Cells Gaming, thank you for the 100 bits. The, ga uh, the graphics are chef's kiss. Thank you very much, dude. Oh, I mean, that's not really for me to say thank you. That's, uh, I didn't make the game look like this. I just installed the shader pack. Um, <laughs> but thank you nonetheless. Ooh, what is this? Hold up, what is this? Red sand? Fuck me! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Right, okay, so horses can get hurt uh, on this spiky stuff, huh? Shit, alright. Good to know. <laughs> Ooh, that scared me a little bit. Um, so, what is this? What is this kind of... What is this kind of desert? I've not seen a red, a red sand desert before. Is this special in some way? Do, 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 do. Oh god. Is this terracotta? What is this? What is this? This is red terracotta. Okay, good to know. I'm probably not going to gather it all right now. But it's good to know that it's here. Oh Jesus, this looks like a nightmare to travel through on a horse. 
and I hear a zombie. So let's keep going. I want none of this. Well, this we're certainly finding interesting things. Uh, it was this spiky thing that hurt my horse, right? Why did my horse get hurt? Was it, or did I land on a cactus, maybe? Damn, can we get over this? We'll try. Oh, God. Uh, here we go. All right. It's the horse challenge, everybody. We're doing the horse challenge. Oh, was it a cactus I landed on? Oh, in that case. In that case, I must not fear the, the dead br brushes, whatever they are. Ooh. All right, I want to be careful here. I need to be on that side of the chasm. Oh god, I'm not, how am I going to get down? <laughs> it's cool. I've literally never seen this biome before in my life. Grand Canyon who? This is a very Grand Canyon. Oh. Oh god, do you trust me? Do you trust me, horse? See, this is why I'm not naming the horse yet, because uh, until I know the horse is safe. Alright. There we go. Alright, we're on the other side of the canyon now. Whoa, look at all this. This is cool. Well, it's good to know that this biome's out here. I think all we need to do now is find a jungle, and we've kind of got a lot of uh, a lot of the good ones. Come on, horse, let's go. You okay? Do you need a drink of water? Or are you all right? All right, we're entering ooh, a savanna, it seems. So we're saying goodbye to the red desert. The red hot desert, although it does appear to still be on our on our left here. The sun's starting to set again as well. I might need to find a place to settle down for the night, you know. Ooh. And more desert, of course. <laughs> Have you ever seen the Grand Canyon? Uh, no, I've not. I'd like to. Ooh! I'd like to. But I've never seen it. I've seen, man, I see pictures of... Uh, people take pictures, like, hanging off the side of the canyon. And it makes my hands sweat. Just looking at it. I hate it so much. Oh, shit, it's getting dark. Um... How do I... Shit, how do I ride the horse? How do I ride... Oh, there we go. No, 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 no. Shit, this is where I die. Because I'm trying to save my horse. No, 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 no. Stop it. Stop trying to escape the hole. I'm trying to keep you safe. <sighs> right. Okay. Another little hole for us to sleep in for the night. I think the horse is safe out there for the night, right? Can't escape. Well, we'll, we'll see in the morning if it's still there. <laughs> Alright, still there. Thank God. Is it safe? Seems safe. Ooh, I hear things burning though. Ah! Yeah, this is the problem when you go out at the crack of dawn. What is this? Purple. Oh, he's wearing enchanted armor. Right, let's avoid him. 
Yeah, we're avoiding that guy, absolutely. What is that, a poisonous spider? Oh my god, please no. Please no. Okay, more desert. Well, we've seen a lot of different uh, stuff out on this Four Corner Expedition. And we're almost ready to head back. I'm feeling good about almost heading back, but though. I like I love being out in the wild, but we're so far from home, you know. We're so far from home. Okay, we are approaching the fourth corner. And I'm gonna be honest. I'm not seeing anything. All I see is desert. All I see is desert. Whoa. Oh fuck. <laughs> you okay, horse? You'll be fine. Oh, what is that? Oh no 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 no! Is that uh, is that what I think it is? Hold on. No 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 no. Is this also a? Is this? Is this another desert temple? Right. Hold on. Let me collect my thoughts. Yeah, that is not something that we wanted to see. Uh... <sighs> right, well, it, it turns out that every corner yielded something interesting. Where's that spider? So I'm just digging a hole for my horse. Just digging a grave for my horse, don't worry guys. So is this another temple? Oh, jeez, okay. Whew. Let's see what we got. So it's not the temple I'm afraid of, it's the, uh... It's the other thing I'm afraid of. Oh, hello. Are you a nice spider? Absolutely not. Where'd he go? He tried to attack me. He jumped at me. We found a lot of these temples. Alright. Seems safe enough. Let's get digging. You all saw it, guys. He jumped at me first. He waged war. War was waged. Perfect music, may I add. Just perfect music. Alright, let's see what we got down here. More treasure for little old me. Don't mind if I do. Do mind if I don't. Oh, well, my axe is about to break, actually. Fortunately, we brought stuff to make another. Uh, I should break this first, actually. Yep. Why did I do that? <laughs> uh, let's. It's safe enough here. So let's go ahead and build a... I have a crafting table. So we're going to build us some magical stuff. Alright. Let's get that TNT as well. Whoo! So if you're unfamiliar with this game, that thing, that, that grey thing that I broke, that's a pressure plate. If you uh, step on the pressure plate, this place goes boom boom. You get the big boom boom, uh, and your game ends. <laughs> uh, yeah. Let's see what we got. Another saddle? Well, who am I to deny all of these saddles, you know? Unbreaking one. Not the most exciting enchantment, but I'll take a couple of golden apples. And more horse armor? Sure, why not? Flame? Diamond horse armor right now we can ride in style flame. I mean, I suppose so 
I'll take it. Fortune 2! Now that's what we like to see. Now we need to get back to the base AFAP. We need to get back AFAP and, you know, get to work. Another golden apple as well. Oh, they stack. Brilliant. Uh, yeah. Let's, uh, and I don't really want other than any of that stuff, so let's go. Let's get out of here. Let's try not to die on the way back. Alright. And I'll tell you what, before we get going, I am gonna put myself in a hole, and I am gonna BRB. One second. A nice safe hole where nothing can go wrong. Uh, <laughs> right, uh, BRB a second. I have returned. I have returned. How are we all? Let's get out of this hole. Is it night time yet? Oh, we can't see. Can't see. Uh, let me get rid of some of this junk. I'll take my crafting table with me. I'll take my torches as well. I'm not leaving my, my perfectly good torches in here. We will never be returning. Alright, that torch can stay, I guess. <laughs> So, guys, correct me if I am wrong, but the thing that is outside of this temple, is that uh, one of those places filled with pillagers? Is it full of pillagers? Because I recall them being quite difficult. I've done, yeah, I've done one of those in... Uh, so I don't really want to go near it, do I? Unfortunately. Well, yeah. Maybe I will come back when I'm more equipped to deal with it. But right now, I am not. Hell yeah. Right, we have to get this horse back now. Look at him, he's adorned with diamond horse armor. Maybe we'll just like poke our poke our head in. Just to have a look from a safe distance what's going on. Yeah, this is as close as I uh, feel comfortable going. Uh so let's get out of here. I think I also see another vi Wait, what is this? What is this? Is this a Nether portal? It's getting dark as well. Um, it's half a net of the portal. Um, is there usually a chest around here? Uh, you know what? We might come back to this. I think we need to find somewhere safe to spend the night. This is getting a little risky for me. So I think we'll come back. We'll remember that's there, and I think I see... What is this? Is this another village in the distance? If it is... Oh, holy day. Holy day. We found another village. We found a village, guys. <sighs> right, let's get our horse safe for the night, and then we'll uh, we'll find a place. Hopefully there's an inn that we can spend the night. Let me dig this hole first. All right. 
in the hole we go. Okay, uh, do, do you guys perchance have residence? Small child, uh, may I per perhaps get out? Um, Angel Simo, thank you very much for the two months. Hi, Peach and Chat. Uh, thanks for all the drunks and japes, you guys. Keep me company during the day and cheer me up. Lots of love and sweet potatoes. Dude, thank you very much. Um, I'm glad you could be here. Glad you're enjoying the streams. Glad you're having a good time. Uh, thank you. All right, let's do a quick little uh, have a look around, see if they've got anything good here. Got anything good? Let me close these doors behind me. Yeah, potatoes I don't care as much about, but I'll take the bread and the apples. I'll come get my horse in just a moment. Uh, there's a house over here as well. We've found some... What's this, so what's this villager called? Uh, what's this... Uh, sorry, what's this village called, should I say? What should we call this one? So we remember... This is quite a lot of houses here. This is quite a big village. You might want to come back here. Kiwi Parasol has redeemed the one, the only, the... Bobby, baby, Bobby, booby. We love to see it. Thank you very much. Ooh, is this books? Absolutely, yes, I'll take the books. I need to clear out my inventory there. Let's get rid of some... Red Terracotta. What do we call in this place? Danger Town. I like that because it's right by Forbidden Danger. It's right by the Pillager's... Hello. Uh, it's right by the Pillager's place, so it truly is a dangerous place. You know, it's got it's a high-risk, high-reward kind of town. Another smithing table. We don't need another one. We barely need the first one, to be honest. The popular tourist attraction. Yeah, I mean, it seems pretty popular. It's huge. Any other chests? A gold nugget, some potatoes. Guys, where's your, where's your diamonds? Where's all your good stuff? i got a right mind to burn this village to the ground. But I won't, because I'm feeling generous today. I'm feeling generous today. High risk, average reward. Yeah. Yeah, basically. Whoa. Oh, I thought that was a statue of a person. <laughs> it's just a farmer. Did I already search this chest? Oh, no. Ooh, emeralds. Hell yeah. Okay. What are you trading? Potatoes for emeralds. Okay. Trading with villagers is the one thing I'm sort of new... I'm sort of new at, but I'm, le I'm learning a lot through my... Uh, my through my other Minecraft game I'm playing. I'm learning a lot about villagers and trading and enchanting and all that. I'm basically learning everything about Minecraft. <laughs> this was a cool place though. So Danger Town then we're calling it. Let me grab my horse and we'll leave Danger Town. I think I can probably swap this out now. Let's go get our horse. Oh horse, where are you? Where do we put our horse? I think it was around here somewhere. Ah, here we go. All right, horse, horse with no name. Let us go, let us ride. Let us ride eastward. So there, that is our third corner, and now the fourth corner is technically our island back home. I think if I want to... Whoa, look at that tree on top of that mountain. That's so cool. That's like a Pixar thing. <laughs> That's so cool. Damn, I want to build a house up there. Wow. It's got floating rocks as well in the sky. Ooh, we've got to be careful here. Big drops. Real big drops. 
and there's lava pouring out the side, molten lava, and a chasm right here. Woo, don't fall down there, baby. Don't fall. Wow, look at that. What a cool place, huh? Lava as well, spilling out. There's lava spilling out, it's like a volcano. There's lava spilling out of all crevices and, and nooks and crannies and, oh no. No! Wait, my horse will get in the boat with me, right? Shit, I don't wanna get this wrong. My horse will get in the boat with me, right? Horse, get in the boat. I'm not gonna tell you twice, get in the boat. Get in the boat. Hey. This is not safe. Uh, what, do I push the horse in the boat? Get in the boat. He will fit. Shit. Maybe we have to ride around this water then, if he won't get in the boat. Alright, let's go the long way. You, I thought they did- maybe horses don't get in the boat. Maybe I'm thinking of a different animal. Mm, can we get across there? How deep is this? Is my horse swimming right now? I can't tell. Oh, hello, that is a creeper hiding in the shadows. In fact, we've got a few things hiding in the shadows here. I don't like that one bit. No siree, no thank you. What? Uh, no, 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 don't stop, don't stop. I got a bit of a quarry here of some kind. Whew. Horses can swim? Really? Is that a Java edition thing? Because in Bedrock, horses can't swim for shit. They drown. They drown horrible, drowny deaths. More lava. Damn, this place is so cool. Got a little waterfall here. I love this. Look at these waterfalls. Genuine, like, just natural waterfalls. This is so cool. All right, I'm 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 dedicated to getting this horse home. Do we have second lead? Do I have another lead at home? I think I might have somewhere. Come on, how we get? Now I've got to make my way across the desert. Right, so I think... Now, will this connect? That's the... Damn, look at that! Holy shit, look at that! Look at that big pool of, like, oasis of water. I want to go check that out. Let's go check it out. We need to get down this mountain first. Oh, this isn't safe. This is Skyrim levels of production here. Skyrim horse physics going on. This is not safe. Alright. Damn, that is beautiful. It's a little oasis here, and I wonder, can we cross the desert, or is this it? Is this the end of the... Oh, this is the end. Shit. All right. We'll be back. We'll be back, baby. We'll be back. Mark my words. We'll be back. For now, survival is uh, number one priority. I propose beach house. We can make a, We could come back and make a beach house. Our home away from home. Again, that time again. I, I'm tempted to just ride through the night, but that's gonna only be dangerous. That's only gonna be full of ravines and holes that I'm gonna fall in. Oh, is this another village? You gotta be kidding me! All right, let's. Uh, oh shit! All right, well, I think we found a place to settle down for the night. We found a village in a red. Oh, wow! Look at this! Look at this! All right. Hello. I come in peace. I 
I'm going to settle down for the night. I'm going to find a little place to settle down for the night. Ooh, and they got a minecart down here. A little minecart system. Um, where can I put my horse? I really should have brought a lead with me. I didn't think I'd need one. Uh, Senna Morley, thank you very much for the the sub. Very much appreciated. Thank you. This, I'm making this. This is like a hotel. Wow, this is going to be my hotel for the night, guys. Holy hell. Holy hotel. Um, hold up, horse. We need to find a place to set you down for the night. Get in the hole. <laughs> Next time I will bring a lead. Next time I will bring a lead. Alright, I'm staying in the hotel for the night. Where's the hotel gone? Where's it gone? That place looks awesome. Over here. This looks great. I love it. Oh, there's no bed. Uh, I actually have a bed. So this will be my room. And in the morning, we'll see what this place has to offer. Is this safe? Can I sleep here for the night? Yeah, I'm sure this is safe. You cannot rest while there's monsters nearby, huh? Or if I move the bed. Well... What about this room? Alright, we can sleep together. We can... Okay, there are monsters nearby, huh? Is there anywhere that is safe? Hmm. <laughs> the bed did match the carpet. It was very pretty. How are you sleeping when there's monsters nearby? Hello? Yeah, there's no room in here, dude. Also, there's monsters nearby. All right, we'll, we guess, I guess we'll find somewhere else to live, uh, to sleep for the night. This will do, I guess. Um, can I place my bed down? Yeah, that, all right, this is gonna be a very snug sleep for the night. Very, very snug. So what is this? This is a... All right, I'm just gonna ask the chat. What is this machine here? Yep. What is this? Yes, hello. I'm asking my chat whether it's worth robbing you or not. A smoker? Is that worth taking? I've got a bit of a full inventory here, but is it... I guess I could... Swap out the dirt or something. I can smoke some meats? Not worth taking? Alright. Not worth for worth it for those smoked meats. Smoking some meats. Ah. Books. Glorious books. Now this is what we want. This is what we want. Because it means we don't have to spend all our leather on books, because I'm eventually gonna want a lot of books so I can enchant. Ooh, zombies. I'll take the bread. I love the Zelda 2 music. This works perfectly for this little village. Do, do, do. Zelda 2, man, is a hard-ass game. I don't know if anyone's ever played Zelda 2 before. It is really difficult. Is it worth taking this wheat? I do have a lot of wheat at home. I don't think I need 12 wheat. I don't think there's anything here I want to get rid of for 12 wheat. This is a big town as well. We've done well finding villages and stuff. Oh, another cartography table? Nothing. Yo, where's all your riches? Where's all your goods? Another smoker for a smoke in the meats. Uh, Woodman, thank you for the two months, dude. Uh, I have uh, been here longer, but uh, love the chill vibes. Uh, dude, thank you very much. Always appreciated. And Peanut Butter Princess, thank you very much for the three months. Hello, lovies. Hello and welcome. Welcome to the stream. Uh, also, Maxis, thank you very much for the eight months, dude. Always appreciated. Thanks for coming down. I hope you're enjoying uh, the stream so far. So where does this go? This is just, this just goes nowhere. You know what? I actually... I wouldn't mind taking. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. 
I don't think I'm going to go down here because there's a dead end. But um, I don't know if it's worth taking the rails. Because it would be cool to put these on our bridge. Ooh, I'm tempted, actually. It'd be cool to put these on our bridge, because then we get across the world quicker. Let me just get rid of something real quick. What can I get rid of? Dirt. Goodbye, dirt. Goodbye, dirt, and hello. Yeah, I'll take the rails. Hold up, horse. I just gotta do some, a uh, little bit more stealing. Because I'd love to put these across my bridge. I, this won't be enough to cover the whole bridge, but um, so it's quicker to get to the mainland. That'll be the perfect setup. Can you imagine it? I can imagine it. All right, you got any more? Is this it? You got any more of those rails? Any more of those rails? Any more? I think we got it all. Right, okay, I think we ride. We ride for the next village. So what are we call in this place? What do we call in this place? Oh. Rail town. Love it. It is officially rail town. Um, Mado Raptor, thank you very kindly for the six months. That's a sweet six months right there. You've been helping my little household uh, through the pandemic and keeping our dog calm during the LA windstorms. Th uh, keep it up and thanks. Dude, that is very kind of you. And are you saying that your whole household watches sometimes? <laughs> if so, very cool. Hello to the Mado Raptor's household. Um, and also, uh, enjoy that golden sweet patat, dude. You've earned it. Let us ride. So I think we're riding for oh, what was the town called? The one out here? See, I'm gonna see I forget these names. Yeah, I like that we've called it Rail Town, despite them no longer having any rails. <laughs> well, we are we call Rail Town because we used to have rails, but I don't know where they went. Someone took all our rails. We don't have the heart to change the name. We don't have the heart to break it to the village elder that we no longer have rails in Rail Town. We fear it would break their heart. It's nothing you can't say that to a hundred year old. Alright, well now I feel bad. Bum, ba -dum, bum, ba -dum. Oh, face cam is covering the map. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, <laughs> it's been like that the whole stream, huh? All right, here we go. Beautiful. Well, there you go. You can now see the map. You can see all the ground we've covered. Come on, let's get this horse home. All right, I think that's the village we've already been to, right? Yeah, I think we've already been to this one. Well, we'll soon know by whether they've um, whether they've been uh, robbed blind or not. Hello, do you all remember me? Oh, there's another horse. It's a floating horse. Oh, it was a floating horse. What do we call this place again? You guys are gonna have to keep remember. Oh, is this no? This isn't Tree Village, I don't think. Or is it? No, Tree Village was the one that doesn't really have many trees in it. This was. Something else, village. <laughs> Just for Ran has redeemed the one, the only, the. Bobby, baby, Bobby, booby. Woo! We love to see it. Thank you very much, dude. Uh, I hope you're enjoying the stream. I hope you enjoyed that lovely Bobby baby. I can't believe we're getting this. We're getting this horse home. I can't believe this horse. We're getting it home. I thought we were going to abandon it in the middle of nowhere, but it turns out. This horse has served us well, and it deserves to come back with us, which means we now have two horses. Well, I shouldn't say that with confidence just yet. Let's actually get home first. Anything could happen between now and then. Like, I don't know, say the horse could drown. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. Up the mountain. Come on. Skyrim style. Let's go. 
man. I'm weirdly in the mood to watch, sorry, to play uh, Skyrim again. Which would be like the millionth time I've played Skyrim. Uh, I saw Gus Johnson was streaming it, and I was like, ooh. Ooh. It's like, it's weird. It's like, Skyrim for me is like junk food. It's kind of like... <laughs> I mean, it's like, it's not a great game. But it, it immerses you. You get into it. I feel like, you know, I've done the same missions over and over, but... I don't know. I think there's other things I'd rather play before I play Skyrim for the millionth time. Um, but, you know, it's one of those things where all it takes is to see someone else playing it, and you're like, Ooh, I could play that again, you know. We're nearly home. Alright, we just need to get to Bridge Village. And then we'll be uh, we'll be on the home stretch. The home stretch being the bridge. Oh, there's so many drops. There's so many drops. You gotta be so careful. Jeez, man. Oblivion? I did not like Oblivion at all. I played Oblivion a long time ago. I played it actually before I played Skyrim, and I could not get on with it at all. I don't know why, but Sky I've, Skyrim I felt quite easy to get on with. It was just, for some reason, Oblivion just didn't work for me. I'm sure it is a great game. Have you played Outer Worlds? I haven't played Outer Worlds or Outer Wilds. Both games confuse me. I don't know which one's which. I've heard they're both, like, good. I heard one's more better than the other one. I don't know which one. Um... Alright, is this a straight path? Can I take my eyes off the screen for a second so I can read the chat? Is Outer Wilds the good one? Which one's the space one? Or are they both space ones? How? Why would they do this? Why would they do this? Why would they release two games so close to each other with such similar names? Why would they do this? <laughs> ah, look at that, guys. We're returning to Fujiland. I have played Spirit Fairy, yeah. I didn't finish it, but we streamed a, a fair bit of it. I kind of want to place, like, blocks just randomly out in the ocean with, um, with, like, lanterns on them to make them look like floating lanterns or something. That could be pretty cool. Now, here's the question. Can we get our horse through the gate? Fuck me. Okay, um, our horse is about to drown. Or is he? Okay, let's not do that. Okay. I say our horse is about to drown. I think I'm about to drown. It's always a little scary. Alright, so I've not perfected that just yet. It's not perfected just yet. <laughs> we will perfect it at some point. Um, thank you very much. Uh, Epica J. Smith. For the, uh, for the 500 bits, I uh, hope uh, your day is going phenomenally swell. Your streams are so chill and entertaining. Always brighten my day. Thank you very much, dude. That is very kind of you. That is very, very kind. Um, all right, whilst our horse... Let me go in here real quick and see if I have another leash. Yes, I do. Oh, perfect. Oh, it feels so good to be back. It feels so good to be home. All right, don't you go wandering off now, buddy. Can I... I can't attach them both to the same... I don't think I have anything to attach it to. All right, you wait here for a second. You wait here for a second. Let me get some wood. Uh, yeah, I need one of these. All right. I only feel like 90% safe in my little compound here. Just because I know that there are a few areas that aren't lit too well. I need to, I think tomorrow I'm going to work on the top of this place. I think that's the plan for tomorrow. I need to, I need to make it a little bit safer. I've got some plans for it. I've got some plans for it. Damn, we got a lot of books. Okay, let's, how many books is this? 39? That looks like 99. Yeah, at some point I'll make uh, I'll make some stables for sure. 
Okay, let's uh, whew, let's unload. We didn't need to use our sword much in the end, which um, I'm pretty happy about, to be honest. Didn't have to get up to too much fighting. Horse armor. <laughs> I don't really. I don't think this is where I put the horse armor. Actually, let's put the bucket of water in there for now. Uh, the boat can go in there. Um, okay. Uh, heart, heart of Bronze, thank you for the Prime sub. Uh, very much appreciated, dude. Do you know how long you're going to be going for today, PJ? Um, I'm not too sure. A little longer, I think. I'm still, I'm in the swing of it. I'm getting into it. Okay, we'll put our, uh, enchanted books in here. I don't know, I don't know what the, the, this barrel's for. It's for things. It's for books and things. Books and things. Every part, uh, the best part of a balanced diet is having books and things. Goodbye, Aria Maeve. Thank you very much for joining us today. All right, we have some food. Let's get these apples in there. Ooh, ooh, this is the wrong chest. <laughs> I saw this and thought, all right, this is food. This is the food chest. Right, this is the food chest. What was that sound? What was that sound? This is a blast furnace. So I started blasting. <laughs> I guess I can cook some of this. Some of this meat. I guess I was smoking some meats. Do, 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 do. I missed two streams and Fujiland is unrecognizable. <laughs> yeah, it, it's had some developments. I'll say that for sure. It's had some developments. We've been working hard. We've been working real hard. We have two horses now. Count them two. We have one... Two. We don't have any name tags yet, so we can't actually name them. But when the time comes, I will be asking for suggestions. So get thinking of suggestions. Don't don't put them in the chat just yet, but think about them, you know? Get, a, get an idea of the ultimate horse name. Okay, gold. We can put the gold away. We can put the iron away as well now. Smelt a bit more iron as well. Do I have a chest for money? I guess I could put it in here. Is that all the emeralds I have? I think so. Alright. Uh, I guess I'll put the rails in here for now. Are you going to get other uh, color flowers from the mainland? Or are you liking the white flower vibe? Oh, I'll definitely get some more... Um, I'll definitely get some more uh, flowers from the mainland. For sure. Okay, uh, I'd love to do my my lantern idea quite soon, but it's not a top priority. I think top priority is getting this place safely fortified. We did a good job yesterday getting it all started, but we're not there yet. We could do we could be doing a bit more to make this place a little safer. Do I have enough uh, enough coal in all these? So where's my stone cutter? Here we go. So I want to turn these bad boys into brick walls. Yes. That is what I want to do. We are going to finish fortifying this place once and for all. Uh, but in the morning, it's way too... It's way too dark and rainy right now, so I'm going to have some sleep. Going to get some sleep. And in the morning... When it's still raining... I don't love going out in the rain because... If there are enemies out there... Okay, has the rain subsided? Yes, okay, beautiful. Lovely. Alright, well... Let's get to work. We've got to protect this place. Now I need to put some lights on the other side of the wall as well, I think. Wait, is this what I wanted to do? Or did I want to do... This is actually not what I wanted to do. Um, hold up. Hmm. 
Why are we doing fences? Um, because in Minecraft you can do anything that your heart desires, and my heart is currently desiring uh, making the top of my walls look more castle-like. So observe, and you will see what I am thinking. Yeah, it looks okay, but I want it to look more than just okay. Uh, I want it to look fantastissimo. Um, so I want them to alternate, I think. Can hear enemies out there. Now it's not the only the unfortunate thing is it's not gonna be perfect. It's not gonna be like each corner will not have you know the desired block. It will not have the desired block. The block that I desire. But ain't that just the way. Bum 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 bum. Whoa. <laughs> we must build our walls higher to protect ourselves. Now the question is, will mobs still be able to... I don't think they'll be able to get over the wall, but I think they can still spawn on the other side of the wall. I think spiders might still be able to, like, get over the side, but... <sighs> spiders don't concern me as much, because spiders are easy to kill. It's the creepers. It's the creepers that are the real problems. The creepers are the real bozos here that we do not want in our house. A creeper in our castle uh, y yard is bad news. It's bad news bears for everyone. I mean, I hear a... I hear a spider right now, actually. <laughs> My god, I want to play Wind Waker so bad now. <laughs> Just listening to this music, man, it brings back such memories. I remember the first time I got, I remember, whoop, don't fall off the wall. Playing Wind Waker, the, the first time I ever played Wind Waker was like, I think it was like in an Argos or something. They had, they had like a, a demo of it on a, ha, play, having a demo in a game, like I was in town with my mum or something, and I remember they had like a GameCube set up with a, with a Wind Waker demo. I was like, what is this? <laughs> I want it. I want it. But I don't think the game was out just yet. Hence why there was a demo. I think the same with Ocarina of Time, actually. Holy shit, in that same Argos, I think many years before, the first time I played Ocarina of Time, I think was... I just played some demo of it. In a shop. I think they had a they had a demo where you were just running around uh, uh, K uh, Kikiri Forest. Wait, what's the first place called again? It's Kikiri Forest, right? I think so. It's been a long time since I played Ocarina of Time. Wait, 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 wait! What's going on? Uh, nobody told me this game had invisible spiders. Is that a, is that a glitch? Or is that... This is why we need to protect ourselves. This is why we need to fortify this place. To stop shit like that from happening. Oh, dude, I need I need another I need another door to get into my I can't 
If I fall off that wall, I can't go all the way around just to get through here. Wow. Wowie zowie. Right, okay. Good to know. So, yeah, I don't know what the deal is with that, but I don't like it. I don't like it. I'd be uh, as I'd be as I'd be as bold as to say I hate it. Husband says it should be your shaders. Yeah, I was worried that was the case. Well, in that case, we're just gonna have to play it safe for a bit. Just gonna have to play it real safe. Damn, dude. Not a fan of invisible spiders. <laughs> spiders are bad enough, but invisible spiders? Mm -mm -mm. No, no, no. <laughs> I don't think so. No, thank you. Oh, shit. This is why we need to protect our village. Clearly, we have a we have an invisible spider problem. <sighs> nope. I do like real life spiders, but invisible? No thanks. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's fair. I think we need a fighting chance to be able to run away from her in uh, even in real life, I'm talking. I think we need a, a chance to at least run away if there's an invisible spider. The thing that was giving it away to me was the fact that there was like some kind of a trail of something going on. I saw a trail that I'd seen earlier in the game. Oops, shit. You can survive a little fall. Oh, oh, I've just remembered something. I've just remembered something. We have got... Fortune 2. And enough diamonds to make a diamond pickaxe. So I think I would like to start thinking about... Enchanting. Quite soon. I'd like to start thinking about enchanting soon. Because if we put fortune on our pickaxe... It means that when you go mining, you can get more uh, more resources. So if I find a block of diamonds, mining one block of diamonds could actually give you maybe three. Uh, is your diamond pickaxe unbreakable? I don't actually currently have a diamond pickaxe, uh, so I would probably intend to um, I would intend to make one. Make some more wool. I don't like these zombie sounds. I believe they they must be somewhere like underneath. They must be under underneath somewhere. Oh yeah, I can't get down there right now. We're we're not gonna worry about that just yet. We got other fish to fry. We got other fish to fry. I love how calm you're staying with the uh, with the <laughs> with the zombie sounds. I mean, there's only so much you can do. You know, sometimes you just got to be. You got to admit. You know what? Zambos. I believe that they're here, and uh, if they want to eat my brains, come and get it. Oh damn! I thought I could hear something. It's raining so hard outside that it's like. These headphones I've got are pretty decent for sound, um, sort of blocking out sounds. Yeah, I could still hear the rain pouring down, uh, hitting the windows outside. I was thinking today how fucking awful the weather is at the minute. I'm so, like, I'm so ready for spring. I'm so ready for it. I mean, it, I don't mind that the weather's so bad right now, because obviously we gotta, we gotta stay inside a lot. So it's like, alright, whatever, I'll, I'll, if the weather's gonna be bad... At least let it be bad when we got to stay inside. Thank you. 
Uh, Squishy Maddie, thank you very much for the prime sub. Much appreciated, dude. I hope you're enjoying the stream so far as well. I've been enjoying the chill Minecraft. Uh, very, I'm saying chill. We are playing hardcore mode. Just as a reminder, we are playing hardcore mode. So I can't get too comfortable. It is Storm Kristoff, yes. It is Storm Kristoff. Come to take away our... Take away our walls. Oh, thank God that that lines up. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, we need to stop falling off these dang walls. An egg? I'm still alive. Fujiland is still going strong. I don't know if I trust this area. I'm going to go to sleep. Now that that invisible spider attacked us, I don't know if I trust it. So I'm going to fall asleep. I'm going to get back in there. But yeah, I am more than ready for a nice bit of spring, please. A nice bit of spring. I want to secure this place. I want to make sure creepers cannot get into this place. If I do all this work and a creeper comes and kills me, it'd be very sad. It'd be very, very sad. I keep mistaking my horse with the diamond armor for a creeper. So we're going to need to do something about that. <laughs> Now, where is that spider? I know that the spiders like to go up into trees. I mean, it's very dark up there. I'll probably need to put some... Um, probably need to put some torches up there at some point. No. system going. Maybe I'll just like fortify these walls and never leave the grounds. <laughs> I don't know about you, but that sounds like a nice idea to me. A nice, safe, cozy place to live. Just for me, my cat, my horses, my chickens, my cows. Oh, it doesn't line up. It nearly lines up. Well, that's ruined my day. <laughs> it's fine. We'll just have to be a little bit not fully symmetrical for one day of our lives. It's fine, guys. Don't worry about it. We had a 50-50 chance for that to be the, the case. <laughs> I I do wonder if our island is going to be big enough for everything we need, but it, hopefully it should be. Hopefully it should be. We should be able to get a farm here. And we could always build up as well. We can always go into the sky if we really need to. That is an option. Hide it behind a tree. Oh, what hides the imperfection behind a tree? Yeah, that's not a bad idea, actually. There we go. Nice. All right. Need some more torches, but, you know. I feel a little safer. I feel a tiny bit safer. I want to move this sand, though. I don't think... This doesn't feel right. Is that chicken on the other side of the wall? Oh, God. How did you get on the other side of the wall? <laughs> I'm going to have to build some more doors at some point. Fort Fuji is looking sick. Hell yeah, dude. Fort Fuji. I like the sounds of that. 
Fuji Island with Fort Fuji. In effect. Sorry, that chicken, he'll find a way in. They always do. If that spider can get in, a chicken can get in. So, I'm trying to think what the plan will be to do next. I really want to check out what's underwater when I keep passing that magma block. I want to know what's down there. Maybe we'll do that. The sound, I believe, is something to do with the fact that we have an underwater... Um, we have an underwater temple somewhere nearby? I think? And it's making all manner of weird sounds. Oh, we got chickens on the other side of the walls! Damn, dude. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Maybe we'll put in some more doors now. Let's grab... Do we have more iron doors? Don't want to spend too much iron making all these doors, but... Okay. And I'll make some more buttons. Hmm. I would like to make a door. I'm going to make two buttons. Oak door. No, iron door. Do I have enough iron? I suppose I could just do this. Alright, I don't really need that many doors, but actually, no, that could work out. That could work out. And I'm also going to need more buttons. Um... Alright. Maybe I'll just make them single doors, actually. I might just make them single doors. Yeah, I'd like, um, I'd like doors to the outside world. Now, can I put this door directly in the middle? Is that gonna work, or should I just do it off to the side? I feel like I'm gonna mess it up if I try to do it in the center. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Move. Nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Well, there's no middle then. <laughs> there's no middle. Unless I do double doors. I kind of want to do. I want to do single doors here. I just want to do a, a, a single door. So maybe I'll do it off to the side here. Hurts, man. It hurts to have to do that. No, wait. Are you escaping or coming in? Honestly, at this point, I don't even care. <laughs> I'm beyond caring. If you want in, you come in. If you want out, yeah, yeah. All right, fine. Are you in or out? Unbelievable. There we go. We have a nice little door to the outside. Uh, I might put one on the other side as well, just in case for some reason we get locked out on the other side of the building. Sorry, the other side of the, um... <laughs> the other side of the fort. I guess this way makes sense, actually, because we could get in a boat and sail off that way, because we could still make a dock out there. We can make a dock. These trees are... Too many trees, man. Uh, so I could do the same kind of thing here, and then put a dock just down there. I don't hate that idea. The chickens cannot be contained. They cannot and they will not. Alright, I'll do it here. To the outside world. Not that we will be going outside. Do, 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 do. Alright. Do I don't think we have enough torches back here, actually. Let's 
Put a couple more. I feel safer knowing there's a couple more down there. Uh, okay, so I think next order of business is to make an enchanting table, although I don't actually know if I have everything I need for that. Let's go check what we need. Uh, or actually, no. Yes. <laughs> actually, yes. Enchanting table, where are you? Smithing. I don't think I have enough. What do you need for an enchanting table? I don't think I have the right material. What is this? Target. Okay. Obsidian. Right. So we need to get some obsidian, huh? All right. So that's what we're going to do. Let's assess the situation, shall we? Egg. Where does egg go? Four eggs. It costs two diamonds. One or two diamonds. Obsidian diamond books. A book two. All right, we've got plenty of books. Um, right, okay, so we've got a bit of a mission on our hands then. Two diamonds. That means I won't be able to make my diamond pickaxe, but that's fine because we'll find more diamonds. We just will. We just will. Do do. Right, let me get some dirt. If we're going on a little mission, we need some dirt. We need some iron. We don't need sand. We don't need an oak sapling. Um, how much wood have we got? <laughs> Not loads. Should we go get some wood? I'm going to just clear up these chests because the... It is starting to bother me how uneven they are. Let's get some more wood. You don't need a diamond pickaxe to mine obsidian. It's just quicker if you do have one. Is it safe? Seems safe enough. Do, 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 do. Oh, you do need a diamond pickaxe for obsidian. Ah. My bad. Okay, so you need a diamond pickaxe to mine the obsidian. Okay, I just have to, I just have to think about the order I want to do all this in. I'll explain my thought process in just a moment. Let me just get a bit more wood, and then I will explain my thought process. Okay, but I will need... If I want an enchanting table, I will need obsidian. Okay. Uh, get back inside. Those dang zombies, man. Okay, first things first. Let's make a bunch of this. And I need a few of these. Um, shoe glue two. Thank you very much, dude, for the sub. <laughs> much appreciated. Thank you. All right, there we go. The room's looking much nicer. It's getting there. We got some more stuff to do, but we look. This is a start of it. This is a start of it. Um. So, let me get rid of some of this wood. Actually, I need torches. That is something I do need. You always need some torches. couple of swords. Uh, I'll take a bucket. Um, and none of this stuff. I will take the shield. Don't need the map. 
Don't need the map. Okay, let me make myself another Chevelle. We don't need this. Uh, I'll leave some of this. I want this. So what I want to do, basically... Oh, I'm going to need more sh uh, more pickaxes as well. So what I want to do is I want to build a diamond pickaxe. Which I definitely... Which I'm going to... I'm going to definitely need to build a diamond pickaxe. But then I'm going to need more diamonds. Oh, God. The order, in, the order here is hurting me. Are you kidding me? Oh no, sorry. Sorry. False alarm. I thought I was being kidded, but no kidding is happening. Um, Dragonfly Warrior, thank you very much for the two months. Best two months of my life. No way, dude. Come on. It can't be the best two months of your life. It's statistically impossible. Um, let's make some more torches. We don't need this iron door. So what I want to do... I mean, this is the order I think I need to do everything in. I need to make a diamond pickaxe, because I need the diamond pickaxe to get the obsidian. But then I need to get another diamond to make the table. I have a book of... I have a book of uh, Fortune 2, which I don't want to use on the diamond pickaxe until I've enchanted it first. Because if I put this on the pickaxe before I enchant it on the enchanting table, I won't be able to put it on the enchanting table. Does this make sense? Basically, I'm gonna go get. I'm gonna have to go find some diamonds to make the enchanting table. But I can't use fortune, which is gonna be painful. Um, unless I mine one diamond, make the enchanting table down below with me, enchant it. No, because then I need to take a, an anvil as well. It's going to be tricky. <laughs> uh, thank you, by the way, uh, Afia Dimu. Afia Dimu? Dimao? Thank you very much for the gift sub, dude. Much appreciated. Thank you. <laughs> I'd recommend not putting fortune on diamond pickaxe. Instead, put it on iron one so that you can use the iron one uh, whenever you find ores and use the diamond for the mining. True. Yeah, that is, that is true. The Fortune Dedicated Iron Pick. And then I suppose I could repair it, couldn't I, with more iron. It's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea. So I would need a smithing table for that. Which is... Uh, gonna take up a bunch of iron. But it would be worth it if I'm looking for diamonds. Sorry, anvil, not smithing table. Uh, okay, so I think smithing table, I need blocks, I need iron, oh, Jesus, I think I need two blocks of iron, no, three, do I need three blocks of iron? This is so expensive, this is so ridiculously expensive. Before I make them, is it three? Oh, oh my god. You're killing me here, dude, you're killing me here. Alright, it leaves me with 49 iron, but it will be worth it. So expensive. Okay, and then it's... And then how do I make an anvil again? Is it... Where is anvil? Where is the anvil? I, yeah, I do have a smithing table, but you can't... I don't believe you can... You can't enchant on a smithing table. Yeah, I will need to get some lapis lazuli as well. Uh, oh, such. Uh, anvil. Okay, for future, this is how you make it. Okay, and now I need to make a dedicated pickaxe. Right, okay. 
Oh my god. So this is the pickaxe we will use for fortune. This is our fortune pickaxe. Why have I put it there? Why is that where I've chosen to put it? Like everything else, let's put it in the wall. Uh, <laughs> Perfect. Right, okay, so we want to give this fortune. Does it cost you more to rename it? It does. Sure, why not? The Axe of Fortune. Fortunate of Fortune. What should we call this axe? What should we call this axe? Funny fortune pun name. What's a, what's a fortune pun? <laughs> or something. Hit me up, guys. What do we got? What do we got? Gold digger. We figured it out, guys. So this will be our, yeah, this will be our specific axe for digging up, for digging diamonds, basically. Okay, so let's take a stack of cobblestone. I need to make this diamond pickaxe as well for the obsidian. That's fine. It's fine. I don't know why, why PJ, why are you being down about it? It's, this is how this is how you do it. You're gonna get more diamonds with that gold digger. Okay? So don't panic. No need to panic. Uh, we will take so we got this. Shield, food. Uh don't need this stone axe. I want a bit more coal. And I want... I'm also going to make a stone axe. Stone pickaxe. Just so i got all all corners covered. You know? Uh, PJ, if I pay you $10, will you do my homework? Uh, absolutely not. <laughs> that is way too expensive. <laughs> Give me just a couple of bucks. Give me a couple of bucks. Hit me over two dollars. Two dollars. I'll do the homework. Okay, I think I have everything I want for this particular mission. So I guess we go down this way, huh? Alright. Pick a direction and go, I suppose. So we need to hit bedrock, and then we need to, from there, we need to find diamonds. Let's start with this pickaxe. Okay, I'll Venmo you in a second. Perfect, thank you. <laughs> uh, thank you very much, Laura McCool, for the Prime sub. Welcome to the sweet potato community, dude. We're playing some Minecraft. We're mining and we're crafting. What am I doing? It'd be much quicker to just strip mine where I've already gone. What am I doing? Uh, let's go ahead and actually, I'm gonna keep these here for now. Let's go ahead and cover this bad boy back up for now. It'd be much better if I just go all the way down here first. Badman Zoe, thank you very much for the prime sub, dude. Very much appreciated, thank you. Uh, oh, we appear to have hit our head. So we'll go down here and we'll figure out where we're gonna go. Bum bum. Bum bum. Bum, bum, bum. So this is bedrock, so 
Zero, I guess. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve-ish, around here. Okay, let's get mining. So we'll start by getting the diamonds, I suppose, and then we'll get the lava. I mean the obsidian. But we'll need to find lava for the obsidian. E okay. No, this is a this is a no F3 um playthrough, guys. Oh, uh, highest bedrock level is level five, so you need to be lower. Ah, I see. So I've actually counted myself up a little bit too much then. Hold on. I thought it's, I thought bedrock started at zero. So in that case, if this is like five-ish, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12 ish? 12? Is this 12? 11, 12? Wait. How have I done that? Is this not where I was just. Oh no, it was. Uh, no. Okay. I covered it up with dirt. Man, it's so dark. I'm gonna have to put a torch in my hand. Oh, hello, Lapis Lazuli. Yeah. Uh, so, does Fortune work on Lapis Lazuli as well? does. Alright, so we're probably going to want to do this. Get working on this. Alright, but then we put this back. We don't accidentally want to start using that for other shit. Uh, is this my... What's this? Stone? Iron. Uh, I'll, I'm going to keep using my stone one for now. Just because stone is like infinite. How much did we get? 32! Not bad! Half a stack of lapis, boys. Ooh, some redstone. I don't really care that much about redstone, to be honest. <sighs> so I'm not really... I'm not going to use fortune on that, because I don't... I really I don't care for it. Oh, I didn't get it at all. Uh, well, I might as well use an iron pickaxe to get it. Get some experience, but... I'm not that fussed about getting it. I've already got some as well, so I'd rather prioritize... I've got to think a bit more resourcefully, because I don't have infinite resources, and I don't have, you know, don't have infinite time. We only have so much time to do this. But if we do find some diamonds, boy oh boy, will I be a happy boy. Will I be a happy boy. Oh, there's some iron. Perfect. Um, yeah, I know, uh, F3 is definitely, is an option that tells you, you know, the level you're on, but, um, I don't know, man, I, uh, I like playing without it, if possible, because, um, I want to stay immersed, uh, and also, it's, you know, my stream, my rules. Because, <laughs> sure, I could quickly press a button and be like, oh, okay, so this is the exact level I need to be on to most likely find diamonds, but, you know, why... I don't want to do that. I hear a bat. Oh, I see water. Okay, we've gone too far. Right, okay, so we only have a certain bit of a area to work with here. What is that sound? We only have a... I did hear a bat, though. Have I been here before? I think the answer is yes. Okay. Okay, let's get going. So we got a bit more iron, so I feel a bit more comfortable using my iron pickaxe now. Also, I need to remember to light the way. My god, I'm gonna get zombied if I'm not careful. What is that sound? Do you guys hear that? Coal. 
Am I running low on coal? I don't think I'm running that low on coal, but I don't think I'll use fortune on this. I don't want to waste my fortune. My good fortune. Is that is that a is that a drowned? Oh God. <laughs> Lovely. Because also, just imagine stumbling upon diamonds without knowing your coordinates. Wouldn't that be so magical? To just happen upon them? Ooh, a bit more iron. I'm not saying no to iron, I just spent a shit ton of iron building an anvil, so... I'll take every single piece that I can get for myself. Punch it with a bucket. Fuck you, Gravel. Oh no, why have I done that? Why have I done that? Why have I drowned myself? Uh, I don't really want the redstone. So we will leave it. Gold? Mm, I don't really care that much for gold either. Despite what this pickaxe may tell you. Digging gold with it will not actually give me any more gold. We're about to break. Uh, do I start using the diamond pickaxe? Uh, I don't really want to do that. This is why we bring resources with us. So we can do this. Don't diamonds spawn near redstone? Um, I, I don't know if that's strictly uh, always the case. But maybe. Now the problem is, I can't really mine it. Because I, uh, I didn't make a iron. Oh, we maybe. We'll go back to it. We'll go back to it. I think anything can spawn near anything in this game. It's completely randomized, I believe. Yeah, what it does tell us is that we're on the right sort of track, I think. You know, that we've been seeing a lot of resources down here, so, you know, we're on the right track. It's snowing in your area. Is this IRL or is this in in Minecraft? <laughs> I've been wanting snow for so long, IRL. But we're just getting shitty rain. That person, thank you very kindly for the five gift subs, dude. That is super generous of you. Thank you very much. This is our digging music. You got a ton of snow a week ago. Damn, dude. Oh. I hear water. Yeah, this is the problem with being on an island, is that we are somewhat limited to... <laughs> You know, the amount of caves we fuck. <sighs> okay. So there's water out there. <laughs> oh yeah, we don't wanna know we don't messing with that. So <laughs> Is it just forever gonna keep flooding if I do that? There's no, like, ooh, mama. There's a lot of magma out there. I 
I'll take a bit of coal. Yeah, I think there's obsidian as well. It's going to be hell to try and mine it. But I wonder if there's a way of getting to it without, like, completely drowning myself. Hello, Mr. Is that obsidian I see before my very eyes? <laughs> and a block of magma. So I feel like I'm playing like a super risky game here, but no risk, no reward. We're all good. We're all good. Yeah, there are easier ways to get obsidian, of course. But uh <laughs> This is the this is the fun way. This is the crazy way to get it. Oh my god. Well, that's what was waiting for me if I'd been down there. I can't seem to There we go. Hmm. This is, uh, this is not smart. What I'm doing here, this is not smart. This is not a smart thing to do. Is that more lava I see over here? No, maybe, yes, no. All right. Now, do I go for it? Is it time? Ooh, mama, I, I hate, I hate that. <laughs> Why don't I give it a go? Why don't I give it a go? The worst that's going to happen is, you know, bad things. <laughs> the best case scenario, we get a piece of obsidian. Let's mine it from a distance and see what happens. Let's mine it from a distance. Water might flood in, but that's okay. Ah, beautiful obsidian. Beautiful obsidian. Well, it worked. <laughs> uh, okay, so we got one piece of the puzzle. One piece of the puzzle. Woo, mama. Mine from a distance. This is why, don't worry, we're not gonna die. This is why we're mining from a distance. Hello. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh god. How much obsidian do I need for the um for the enchanting table? Does anybody know? Four. All right, very well then. Very well then. I will make it so. Why is this still flooding? Ah, I see. Do 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 do. It's mine from a safe distance. Look, 
sure, there's a bit of lava out there. What's it going to do? Kill me? <laughs> Did I just hear a skeleton? <gasps> I'm okay. Uh, Reese Keish, thank you very much for the two months. This song always gives me peach vibes. Oh, really? <laughs> thank you. I'm flattered. All right, this one could be a bust. This piece of obsidian could be a bust. Yep. Nope. Almost. It was almost a bust. All right, I'm just gonna grab this piece and right. Be, I'm gonna be gone. We have five pieces of obsidian. We have one more than needed. Uh, so eventually we will also. We know where to go to build our. Our uh, nether castle thing as well. Nether castle? Nether portal. <laughs> Our nether castle. Uh, I will leave that crafting chest. No, what am I... Uh, I'm going to dig from here. I think we do have, actually, we've got, like, a bit of a chasm somewhere that we can go exploring if we want to have another chance of finding any kind of diamonds. Coal. Okay. Coal is fine. I'll take coal. Could be digging for a while, guys. Uh, I'm just using my regular pickaxe, just a regular iron pickaxe. Nothing too special. Oh man, guys, uh, I nearly had a big accident. So in my um, in my Switch version of the game that I'm playing with some friends, I've got a like netherite chest plate. I've got a netherite sword that's like enchanted with all the best enchantments. I've got a netherite pickaxe, all the best enchantments. I've got other full diamond armor, all enchanted with amazing enchantments. And I was in the nether and I was being super reckless. And I dug out some lava and I couldn't get out. Um, I could not get out. I was so, so screwed. Um, and I had that baby in my hand. Uh, you know, you can get this like little... Oh! Well, look at that. We found it. Without using F3. How about that? Uh, but I was holding that baby thing. Totem of Undying. There we go. I knew it had a name. Um, yeah, we... Uh, uh, we used the... I, I had the baby thing in my hand. And I survived. <laughs> I survived. It was absolutely terrifying. My um, my heart was pounding. I thought I was about to lose all my best gear. I was very, very worried. Look at this, guys. We're we're doing it. Uh, we can. Let's see. How many diamonds do we think we're gonna get from this? Let's do a. Let's do a little poll in the chat. Let's do a poll. Hold on. Uh, okay. How many diamonds? So we're going to do... One, four, eight, twelve. Very arbitrary, I know. Let's do a poll. One, four... Your options are one, four, eight, or twelve. Vote away. <laughs> Based on the information you see before you. What do you think? Keeping in mind that we do have 
uh, uh, an axe of fortune. So we might get a couple more, but this might be just one block. This might be a single block, in which case we might get... We might get maybe one or two diamonds. Let's see. People are saying four. People are voting four. Um, so I hope this isn't like a manifestation thing. I hope we're actually going to go... I hope we're not going to get four. I'll take four. I'll be happy. I'll be very happy with four. At least one. Right, well, the votes, they're coming in at four. Fours have it. Right, let's see. You say there's lava behind it. Should we check just to make sure there's not? Because that would be very... We don't actually... Yeah, I should be careful here. All right, well, there's at least two blocks. That's good. Ooh, and some iron. At least three blocks, guys. At least four blocks. Can we do five? There's at least four blocks. Let's check above. I think we're just, I think we've got just four, which is fine. I'm not greedy. I will take, I will absolutely take four. But how many diamonds will we get? How many diamonds will we get? Little cube, uh, little cubes and tea. Thank you very much for the, uh, thank you very much for the sub. Much appreciated, dude. So, all right, let's see how many diamonds we get then. One, great. Three. Four, five, great, we got five. Wowie zowie. <laughs> five, luckily that is enough for what I need it, what I need. That is very disappointing, but fine. <laughs> That's fine, uh, we, we can do what we need. And look, some more lapis lazuli, so how about that, guys? Yeah, we only got Fortune 2. We found it in a book. We got a book, so I thought, might as well use it. We don't have a huge amount of resources to work with, so I'll, uh, yeah, I'll just use that. Yeah, let's use the Lapis. I mean, let's get the Lapis, sorry. And let's get out of here. We've done what we need to do. Uh, I don't want things spawning down here in the darkness. I'm just going to put a torch there. Okay. Yeah, Fortune 2 is not too bad. It's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. So let's get back to the surface, and let's do a couple of things. Although, I would have preferred to be in level... Because um, I want to enchant my diamond pickaxe. But I would have liked to have been level 30 first. So maybe we won't do it just yet. Maybe we won't do it just yet. The music makes me feel like a safe hobbit. <laughs> oh, you're anything but safe right now. Because we are collectively controlling this character. If I die, we all die. And, uh, yeah, we're not safe. <laughs> but I'm glad you feel safe. I heard a skeleton drawing its bow. Oh, I'm going to mute the music for a second. Where is he? I don't want to get obsessed with this again, but... Last time we played... No, I'm not going to get obsessed with this again. It takes too much of my life span away from me. There are, like, enemies in the walls... And I desperately want to find where they are. <sighs> no. Not right now. Not right now. How long have we been alive? Uh, give me one second and I'll check. I just want to um, get back to the surface. Back to true safety. 16 blocks in every direction. Oh, is that the way to find out? Rrr. It just annoys me because they're so close to my house. 
They're so annoyingly close to my house. Are you... It's fine. It's fine. We'll find them on another stream. Not tonight. Not tonight. Why can't I jump up? Oh, I need another ladder. This is really bugging me. Uh, <laughs> I need another piece of ladder here. Um, all right, we'll make another crafting table. Fine. Uh, I go by Kami. Thank you very much uh, for the prime sub, dude. Much appreciated. Yeah, I know it's the ladder, but I don't. I don't understand why I can't. Uh, why it's not working? It's fine. We'll add another ladder. I thought I'd be able to like jump up, place a block, and. Uh, but no, it just wants more ladder. It just wants more ladder. Let's go. All right. So let's have a look at our spoils then, shall we? We got some good stuff. We got five diamonds, which brings our grand total to six diamonds. And a diamond pickaxe. So not bad, not bad at all. Uh, so what will we need? Diamonds, we need... Let's get rid of some of this stone now. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. We need our obsidian. Oh, we also need to make a load of uh, book tables. I don't think we're enchanting tonight. We we got a... Um, we got a bunch of stuff to do. We got a bunch of stuff still to do before we can actually start enchanting. But I could probably build the enchanting table tonight. Two diamonds, some obsidian, and a book. Let's do it. Very nice. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna put this down somewhere for now. But uh, I know that I need to build like a special room for it and surround it by bookcases. So don't you worry. I'll uh, I'll get on that. I think for the next stream, uh, I think that's something to do. We still have a floating cactus. Uh, <laughs> maybe we'll move. Let's move the floating cactus. How about that? That's something we can achieve today. No problem. Beautiful. Uh, excuse me. How did you get in here? How did you get in my compound? You son of a bitch. You're not supposed to be here. Ooh. Not today, thank you. Burn, baby, burn. He burns. He burns. Anything else want to mess with me? Didn't think so. All right, I'm going to also remove this real quick. Emmy Speed, thank you very much for the eight months, dude. That is very, very kind of you. One more month for that sweet baby patat. Hell yeah, dude. Uh, you're going to get that ruby sweet patat. It's going to be a, a Twitch baby. So um, prepare everything you need to prepare. And I think, guys, this might be... Where we round things off today. Productive stream. Very productive stream. We started out by doing the Four Corners Challenge, which is where we... Uh, it's just something we set ourselves to do. Which is where we visited every corner of the map. Well, basically every corner. Apart from... Um, I guess apart from the bottom right corner. But I'm assuming that's just ocean. Um, so we've, we've seen all the corners. We found some really interesting stuff. We found more villages, more um, temples... We found uh, a sort of a red sand desert. We also found a pillager's uh, outpost. I don't know what you call it. A pillager's tower? I don't know. But either way, we haven't we haven't actually taken them on yet. Maybe at some point if we're feeling brave, 
Uh, maybe we will um, build some better armor for ourselves. If we can get full diamond armor, that would be great. That would be really great. But uh, we'll see if we can be so lucky. The Badlands, yeah. <laughs> Basically, yes. Uh, but I think for today, that is just about going to do it. So I'm going to put away my stuff. Let's just sort our stuff into chests and we're going um, to round it off there. I need to make some signs. Maybe next stream we'll make some signs for these chests so I know where everything goes. Let's put our diamonds in here with our lapis lazuli and our redstone. Books can go in the book cabinet. Uh, wood can go in here. I got some prime five-star dirt that can go in there. Uh, where would I put obsidian? Just in there for now, maybe. Oh, do we have a Bobby baby? Uh oh, uh oh. The Night Fury has redeemed the one, the only, the Bobby baby, Bobby booby. Woohoo! Is that three today? Three tonight? Me, oh my! Three Bobby babies in one night. It is a thing of beauty. It is a thing of beauty. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, all right, and then our eggs. All right, great. Great, good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Where are we putting arrows? Are we putting that with our weaponry? All right, we will also find the source of that zombie sound because it is pissing me off. We've clearly buried a zombie underground somewhere, or we've we've got a hole underground where it's super dark, and a zombie has spawned down there, and we need to kill it. So that will be our challenge for the next stream, I think. Kill the zombie. Uh, Iridium Eel, thank you very much for the 100 bits. Congrats on another day. Hell yeah, dude. We survived another day. Oh, and we were going to check how long we've been alive. So far, we have been alive for... 0.62 days. Why is it phrased like that <laughs> 0.62 days I don't know what that is in hours but um, you know if we can last a whole day if we can last 24 hours that would be great I would be very happy with that 24 hours I would be very happy with that um, but yeah good day of survival the island's coming along if I don't do anything stupid we might um, we might get somewhere here 14.8 hours. Thank you for working that out. Thank you. Uh, depressed geckos. Thank you very much for the prime sub, dude. Uh, welcome, welcome to the sweet potato community. Damn, almost 15 hours. Not bad. Well, we're going to save and quit there. And we're going to get out of here. Uh, guys, thank you very much for joining me today. I hope, I hope, I hope you enjoyed the stream. We had some fun times today. We had some good junks. We had some some good stuff. Uh, noodle in a cup. Thank you very much for the eight months, dude. Much appreciated. Uh, goodbye to you as well. Uh, goodbye to one and all. Uh, I hope you enjoyed tonight. Uh, we'll be back on tomorrow at some point. I don't know when. I know today was a bit of a later one. It's like it's gone 10 now. It's 10 past 10 for me. Um, so I'm going to go and uh, chill. I'm going to go chill for a bit. Uh, Laura... McCall, thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, when is the next Minecraft stream, PJ? Thank you for today. I'm going to probably be on tomorrow. And then I think Friday, I'm going to aim to do more Lego with Sophie. Uh, we've still got more Lego to build. We have we built the Lego NES. but we, There's more components that we need to build. We need to build the, um, the TV portion of it. So I think we're going to probably do some more Lego then. But uh, we'll do a bit more Minecraft tomorrow because, um, hell, I'm loving the Minecraft, dude. I'm having so much fun. I truly, it truly feels like every decision matters, and you have to really take into account every danger and every, like, little something, you know. And don't just, you know, you've got to actually consider, wait, do I want to build an iron pickaxe instead of a, a, a no, sorry, do I want to build a stone instead of an iron pickaxe? Because I've only got lim limited iron. So, um, yeah. you got to think about all these decisions, you know. you got to think about everything. Do I jump down this hole, or do I find another way down? Um, so, yeah. How did I miss a Lego stream? <laughs> yeah, we did it um, earlier on, maybe... Oh, we did it on New Year's Eve and New Year's Day, actually. Um, 
The VODs are on my channel if you want to go back and have a look. Uh, I, I put them in, I archive them, so you can go back and watch them. Uh, as I do with pretty much all of the streams. Um, so yeah. Cheyenne is doing art. Should we raid? We could do a raid. We could set up a raid if you give me just a second. I can set this up. Um, well, guys, thank you very much for um, spending tonight with me. Uh, thank you for the subs and the gift subs and the bits. Always appreciated, so thank you very much for that. Thank you for any new follows. If you're new here, then thank you very much. Um, let's go ahead and do a... Do a little. Uh, we'll do a raid on uh, on uh, Shane Barton, who is uh, making some art right now. If you'd like to join in on the raid, get in on it, and uh, we'll we'll send some sweet potatoes their way. We'll be uh, we'll we'll be we'll be nice. We'll be kind. We'll send them some love, and uh, yeah. And guys, I'll see you in the next stream. So take care. Be cool. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.